Hello folks. I want to greet you this evening and just leave a short message with you. Uh, Saturday night, I made my first effort at giving a YouTube message. And tonight I want to explain why I made that. Is that by all means, don't feel sorry for me. I am thankful for all the things I went through in life. And I am bringing you tidings of good joy because Jesus saved me. He forgave me. And now my life is victorious. And yours can be too. And I want to share with you that many ministers, they bring a message. People bring a message. They say, oh, you must be born again or you have to have a new life, a new life. I want to tell you how you get that new life and how you are born again. It says in the Bible, except a man be born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. And I knew that all the time I was running, but I ran from him and I bowed my neck. All the time I was running into the bars and every place else I shouldn't be at, all the sins I was committing, Jesus was calling me. He knew I was his. He never gave up on me. Jesus kept saying, Steve, you're mine. You're mine. And now I realize the mission he has for me. And the way I was born again, the way I got a new life in Christ, is I got down on my knees and I humbly said, Jesus, I am so sorry. I am so sorry for the sins I committed. Now I can't undo them, but I can rely on Jesus to forgive me. And it says, if you confess your sins, he is faithful and just to forgive you your sins and to cleanse you from all unrighteousness. It took me a long time till I realized that Jesus could forgive me for all of that. But I prayed, and this is what you have to do to be saved, to be born again. Jesus, come into my heart, come into my life, forgive me for all my sins, all my unrighteousness. Please forgive me and make me new. Put your Holy Spirit within me so that I can be a new man. I'm not the Steve Fry I used to be years and years ago. I'm a new man. When you do that, he will faithfully forgive you and he will cleanse you. He will cleanse your thoughts, your minds, everything. Now, friends, if you have anger, hatred, greed, gossip, pornography addiction, alcohol addiction, stealing, anything else that's sinful. You can bring it to Jesus and he will forgive you. He will change it and he will make your life pure. And there's a song that goes like that. It says, from glory to glory, he's changing me, changing me, changing me. His likeness and image to perfect in me, the love of God shown to the world. Yes, he's changing me. He's not done yet. I haven't reached perfection by a long, long ways. But he put his Holy Spirit within me speaking to me. And he's changed me. He's forgiven me. And he's changing me a little bit each day as I pray and walk with him. So as you watch that first YouTube that I presented, is to be joyous. All I'm telling you is all the bad things that I went through that led to the victory in Jesus Christ. The victory in Jesus Christ far outshadows the sad times. And I am so glad that I went through every single bit of that because now I know 
that Jesus has something special for me. And as I go in back in this and go back in my history and tell you this stuff, you will realize what I'm saying. Because now I know beyond the shadow of a doubt, further down in the story, when I'm out fishing, and Jesus said, Steve, I have something miraculous for you. And I'll explain that. But Jesus gave me a special mission. And that is to go out to you in love and kindness. And my heart is pouring out to you that you would come to know Jesus, that you would know him as your personal savior. Not just as a person sitting in the front row of church, religious fanatic that doesn't really know Jesus, but that you would get to know him intimately so that you would get out of bed in the morning and say, Holy Jesus, Lord God Almighty, I know you and I love you and I want you to lead me today. Thank you for all your blessings, Jesus. That's the joy that's in my life. Hey, before I go, could I have a quick word of prayer with you? Please? Dear Jesus, I come to you today that you would bless this little message that my friends watching it would be blessed. That somebody watching it would come to know you. That they would get on their knees and say, Jesus, come into my heart. Save me and forgive me. Please, Jesus, that you would use me just to touch somebody's life. And that you would humble me. Lord, I need you every day. I need to come to you humbly, Jesus. And I thank you for forgiving me and for giving me a mission to go and tell people. I thank you and praise you today, Jesus. Oh, Lord God, I could sit here and pray and praise you all night long. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. Amen.